It's the sesquicentennial in Auburn. But even though the city was incorporated 150 years ago on February 22nd, the year-long celebrations start on New Year's Eve. For the fireworks and live music. This is a special event for us. We had to do it right. Planning for Auburn's free New Year's Eve anniversary was a year in the making. Our VIP section has sold out. We have 300 people in there. Um, and then we're anticipating anywhere from 1,000 to 1,500 throughout the night between the three different bands. The food trucks and just to support the local activities. Karen Taylor is getting ready to celebrate in Maine after moving back from Hollywood, California. My friends and I are going to meet down here. It's simpler than driving to Portland. I got an invitation to go to Portland, but I don't want to drive. Other locals are booking rooms downtown. So a lot of them are doing a staycation. They're, you know, taking hotel rooms right across the street so they don't have to drive home the 10, 15 minutes. You know, the, the community is really excited about it. So, I mean, why not come and be a tourist in your own town? Crews have been setting up since 8 a.m., counting the minutes to say Happy New Year and Happy Birthday. And according to the Auburn 150 website, this is the first official New Year's Eve celebration in the city's history. In Auburn, Clay Gordon, News Center, Maine.